Hey guys, how are you doing? I hope everything is well by you. I hope the Creator reveals His mercy and His endless kindness upon you all and upon all your loved ones. This is a, a great day. This is an amazing day. This is a day of great opportunities um, to start the new year in a positive mindset to try to push and pull ourselves toward good things, not to back off and not to give up on our dreams and on our goals. That's the main thing that I can uh, and that I feel I should um, cheer you up to do and push you toward. I believe that we all have an amazing, enormous power and it's been revealed to me in so many ways in my own private life and walking on my own um, private individual path to see and to recognize tremendous amounts of power that is the real true potential of a human being, of a person. The verse is saying, Mina Metzar Karat. The verse is saying, Min HaMetzar Karati Ya Anani Bamirchav Ya. I call the Creator from the narrow places and from the width, from the open space, the Creator answered me. Like we blow the shofar that is narrow in its beginning, that's where you put your mouth, that's where you blow the shofar and the voice is coming out from the wide end of it the salvation is appearing the voice of salvation is appearing from the from from the horizon from infinity <clears throat> it means that the person that finds himself in those constrictions in difficulties in challenges should just learn how to scream should just learn how to express his heart should just learn how to never back off um, on expressing his honest heart, his, his beautiful soul. My journey of coming closer to the Creator started from complete emptiness and darkness. I didn't know the Creator was exist at all. I was not observant. And here found myself dedicated and still dedicating my life to an, such noble and divine purpose helping so many souls and making so many wonders in lives of, of others and especially in my own life, being a, a true believer and, and searching for the Creator in every situation of my life and always motivating myself and the ones who depends on me and willing to listen to, to my voice, to have faith, to have emuna, never to give up on their goals, on their dreams. And also spiritually, the person can find his prayers being answered in such magnificent and beautiful ways. A person can find his Avodat Hashem, his effort and his work while trying to do the best he can, being answered and being accomplished in so many beautiful ways that it's a blessing, that it's a huge, huge blessing that is coming from <clears throat> from such a divine source that is reminding you of your true existence, of your true being. You look at the mirror and you see a shape, you see a portrait, you see a face, you, oh, that's my nose, oh, my eyes, my forehead. That's not who you are. That's the way you are wrapped. That's the way that you are, um, that, that you are being offered to the external world when you, in reality, you are a source of blessing. You are a godly portion of heaven. And you should learn who you are. You should find your true self. You should dig deep into the roots of your spirit, of your soul. And how you do that? You should just be simply honest with it. With your journey of finding your true self. You should ask yourself, who am I? And to listen, who am I? I like to paint. I like to eat chocolate. I like to learn Torah. I like to jog early in the mornings be before it's getting hot in the noon time. Okay, so that's you. What does it mean? Why am I enjoying jogging? Why do I like chocolate? What chocolate does for me? All those questions, when you're gonna ask them, 
you'll find answers. When you ask the Creator with truth, you will be answered. The Creator is close to everyone who asks Him with truth, that calls Him with truth. Whenever you ask even the most simple question, who am I? Why am I so wrapped after those uh, chocolate bars? Why am I so stuck with these um, challenges over and over? Why do I struggle with with making money? Why well, don't know how to uh, educate my children properly? When you ask those questions from an honest place, trying to be honest about it, trying to build yourself and to find the real answer, the Creator will show you how close He is to you. It means that He will bless you to be answered, to find the real answer to all your questions, to find the solution to solve all your problems and to erase all your doubts and to avoid all your fears and to find salvation and true redemption in your private life, in your individual life. And also to know and to learn how to share it with others. That that's the secret of our existence. We're here to share. Your face can be seen. Your voice can be heard. Your, your, your talents can, can make an impact, can, can make a change in the world if you're going to use them properly. So that's the purpose of your life, to use the blessings that have been treasured inside of you for the benefit of the whole wide world, to give and to share and to spread and to illuminate and to hand it out to your surroundings, to your closest circles and to those circles that are a little bit more far away from you but still can enjoy your voice and your talents and your wisdom and your sense of humor if you have one and all the good things that you've been blessed with so every person on earth I'm calling you wake up be your true self don't be afraid to express your feelings and you should remember that rule when negative thoughts attacks attacks you it's the evil inclination attacks you. When positive thoughts are washing you and purifying you, those are thoughts that are coming from the root, from the uh, source of your soul. And you should connect yourself only to the positive ones and just to ignore the negative ones. Go with your blessing and be happy. Be who you are and don't give up on your goals and your dreams. You're a beautiful creation of heaven and you've been sent here to this world for a purpose, for a cause. Go with it and don't back off and don't give up. And let everyone on earth know how beautiful and gorgeous and, and charming they are. And the Creator will answer our honest prayer in no time and will see the complete redemption, hopefully, hopefully this year already. And with time it will happen for sure in our lives. Amen. Você está assistindo Emoná Português. Seu apoio nos ajuda imensamente. Por favor, inscreva-se, curta e deixe-nos um comentário com qualquer dúvida que você tenha. O melhor de tudo é simplesmente compartilhar este vídeo, ajudando essas mensagens de fé a chegarem a todas as pessoas. Não importa a sua origem. Fique bem e Shalom!